Alright, so welcome back to the channel and today we're gonna check out the Pelican Shield Kevlar case for the iPhone 15 Pro Max. It also came with a built-in holster so you can attach it in your bag, on your belt, or in your pants. So your phone is always with you, especially this time if you consider to always travel with you with your phone. And maybe one of the best ways to, to carry it with you is using this Pelican case. So we're gonna check it out. So first of all, as you can see, it is attached in my everyday backpack. So we, I, I, I have no problem with it. And then if you want to access your phone, there's a clip here or an indentation that you can push and then get your phone. And then you can attach it different ways. You can attach it with the screen in front, covering the screen. So you have protection in your screen and showing your camera. I think you can even be a blogger with this while walking. And then just shooting the surroundings in your place. So that's very handy. You don't need a tripod or anything. Another way is that you can change the orientation. There's like a locking mechanism that you can just twist it this way. Or if you're comfortable, put it in this portrait mode. So whichever you're comfortable with, uh, Pelican will surely have your back. And then you can just easily remove it. So we can take a look at this case. This is the Pelican Shield. So first of all, let's remove the holster itself. And let me just show you the use of the holster. So you have your clip here and you can change the orientation as mentioned. So you, you can have put it different orientation, however you may feel comfortable with. And also you can lock it so it can double as a stand for your phone. So very handy if you want to put it next to your computer in this orientation or in a portrait position but it's a little bit slanted for some of your taste but it's good as like a double screen for your computer and if you're done you just push this indentation here to remove the lock and there you go you can just uh, take it off on and off how how you may like it you want it to be uh, in my situation i never use a holster a belt on my phone because Usually, I'm a little bit more of a minimal person as much as possible. But if you don't use this one, you can just decide not to use this one. And then let's check, check out the case itself. This is like a two-piece material. We can remove the materials first. So this is the rubber. So very, very protective. Actually, the Pelican case is rated up to 21 feet of drop protection. I feel like that after you use your iPhone 15 Pro Max for, let's say, two to three years and you want to change your phone and you want to pass it like to your children or grandchildren this is a very pristine condition uh if you notice when i did the unboxing of the iphone 15 pro max i will link it on the description below that the iphone 14 pro that i compare it with is very pristine so one of the reason for that is because i'm using cases for the entire lifespan of my phone case so first of all let me show you how you assemble the case itself so let's just put this rim first so we put it on top we align everything and then push everything in and then once it's securely in and then secure everything in bottom first sides and side and make sure that everything is wrapped properly so now there you have it the phone is inserted there so no problems at all because the fit is really really nice um let's check out the case itself so at top we have nothing and then on the sides you have cover for your action button to be honest the action button of mine is set to you have a plop here to pull um set on two so really you need to dig it with your palm mute toggle switch and there you have it. So no problem at all. Um, it makes me not use my action button less often now because of this flap. Volume up and volume down. So um, not, not the clicky button that I tested, but they will respond accordingly. So no problem at all. You have your grips on this side. Very subtle. Um, looks like a brick style of um, grip here, but very grippy. I never found this case slippery at all. At the bottom, you have plop for your USB-C. Very good to keep away some dust. But you know, one of the, my concerns is that these kinds of material is one of the case that, um, part of the case that very easy to, to break. You know what I'm saying? Because every time you pull this one in and out, 
Um, this one is like being stretched all the time and they can break easily. It's just me, but that's what I'm thinking. But if you don't like to access your USB-C all the time, um, this is this case is also MagSafe compatible, so very easy. No problem at all. It will work with wireless charging. One more time. It's charging now, but let me show you the animation. So no problem at all. It will work with your regular MagSafe accessories. And let's go back to MagSafe later. Now let's check out the design of this case. So this is really boxy case. Every time I'm holding it, I wish that the iPhone corners are not uh, what um, not rounded because it really looks different here. Uh, as I put this case here, it makes the case look uh, squarish compared to the round corner. So it just... Um, first impression, maybe after a long time of using this, I, I may find it differently. And the grips are really, really good. They are not, they got, they not, uh, you will feel secure with this case. And then looking at the back, you have your Kevlar here. According to them, they have their special coating so that the case will look new. Um, I feel like it's working. Even though by close up, you can see a small, small scratch, even though it's working really well. And then I also like this looks like realistic screw on the corners. So in this corner, you have a nice um, screws here and then Pelican branding on this side. So this is very smooth, though it's attract some grease in my hands. And as I mentioned, as you put your case here, I feel like over time, you will feel secure that you can pass this to the next generation in pristine condition. Also, let's talk about the MagSip because this is a MagSip uh, capable case. We can try some accessories aside from the wireless charger let me just bring the rhino shield aqua stand so we can see how is the magsafe strength of this case also we're gonna try it with pop socket magsafe wallet so this is a rug case so let's see how it will handle some magsafe testing so putting on the wallet not bad at all and let's just Normal usage, shaking it, holding it in your hand. So not bad at all. Very good. Let me just give it some shake test. Oh, actually, this one has a very good MagSafe strength. Compared, um, pair it with top socket MagSafe wallet. So very nice at all that we have good and strong MagSafe, even though this is considered a rug case. Another materials that we can use or accessory is the Rhino Shield Aqua Stand. And let's just... Attach this one here and let's try to lift this one up. No problem at all. That's nice. Oops. As you see, it, it, it fell, but it disconnect. But not, not bad at all. I feel like everyday accessories, you will have no problem with it. And as I mentioned, if you feel like it's disturbing you that you have to open this one and close it to charge your phone, I have no problem with that. My, my normal cord works perfectly here. You can still use some wireless charger. So this is our Pelican rug case for the iPhone 15 Pro Max. Very durable of up to 21 feet of drop protection. It also included a holster clip that can be very useful depending on your life scenario. And if you want to integrate it in your life, I feel like this is full of potential. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you consider to subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button and until next time, thank you.